All verse rising, my soul family. All verse rising to my supreme soul beings of the angel number multiverse, man. Now, let me tell you this. A lot of those demonic, empty, vibrational haters that were always hating on the soul beings who was calling out this white supremacist, demon energy, vampire, blood, demon matrix system that is a slavery to human citizens. Those will be the same haters when it's when the system crash, these haters who, who label soul beings conspiracy theorists are going to want help from these soul beings that they was hating on so much. Let me tell you why, man. Like people that are like soulless vibrational beings, like the righteous Trelos of the world, the, the fucking Shamar Moss Williams of the world, the fucking Coley Dixons of the world, all these soulless vibrational demons that I have listed and so many more soulless vibrational demons that were hating on soul beings. For calling out a, a system that's so fucking demonic to this planet called Earth. Those soulless vibrational demons are going to want help from us soulful vibrational beings. And I'm going to be like, fuck no, get out of here. You was the one hating on me. Righteous Trey Lowe was hating on me. Shamar Moss William was hating on me. The Coley Ditson faggot was hating on me. Like all these motherfucking soulless vibrational gang stalking demons who are not spiritual beings was hating on all soulful vibrational spiritually awake people who don't fall victim and be a damn zombie to the damn matrix. Like seriously, man. Like bro, all the conspiracy theory label people, they're going to be the ones who is going to be able to get all the energy acclimation from the sun, the moon, any type of weather it is that's connected with father and mother nature, right? This is all facts, man. So Shamar Moss Williams, fuck you. Righteous Trello, fuck you. Coley Dixon, fuck you. Fuck all you motherfucking soulless vibrational demons, man. I don't give a fuck if y'all get mad. Because why? When the system crash, you mark my words. You fucking demons are gonna come crawling to me. And be like, damn, you was right the whole time. I don't know why we was hating on you. Now I'm be like, I told you so. I told you so. You should never label us soul beings, us conspiracy theorists. Like, bro, when the system crashed, all these people who thought that they was hot shit being CEOs of a, of a particular organization, a part of a fraternity, you know, all this other matrix bullshit that's not connected with father and mother nature. They're going to be the ones that's going to crumble and be melted in the sun, especially the ones that have my skin tone. Just because they got my skin tone, but they fit in the matrix, that doesn't mean that they're going to be thriving with the energy of the sun and the moon. They're going to crumble and melt and be burnt away. Like for real. Like anybody that is a soulful vibrational being that doesn't fit in the matrix are going to be the ones who's going to be connected with father and mother nature when the system crash, when people can't rely on the matrix system no more. Why do you think so many soul beings that do so many exercise workouts in the sun, snowing, all these different weather conditions. Why do you think they do that? They do that to get themselves prepared so they don't fall to the damn FEMA camps that's coming up when the system crashed. And all you people that was laughing about FEMA camps is not gonna exist, man. You're gonna be looking crazy when you get fed to these damn demons for, for fucking blood sacrifice rituals when the FEMA camps happen. Of course. Would it take for a person like Lil Yachty to tell you this? Would it take the person like the baby to tell you this? For you to take this stuff serious? Would it take Joe Biden to tell you this? Or would it even take a damn pastor to tell you this? It shouldn't it shouldn't have to take them. It shouldn't have to take them. I'ma tell you this right now. We soul beings that get that get so much energy from the sun, this whole multiverse essence that's connected with father and mother nature, we the ones are gonna thrive. And like, look, man, all these soulless vibrational energy vampires and shit that always want to try to gaslight and downplay what soulful vibrational spiritual beings say, man, they those energy vampires are going to be looking real mad crazy out here. They're going to be looking mad lame. Like any soulless vibrational being that was hating on me and shit, like when the system crashed and they don't have any way to use anything that was connected to the matrix. They gonna be helpless and I'm, I'm gonna be like, man, fuck out of here. You bugging me. Like, come on, man. Like, what we talking about here? Like, I'm gonna just be like, man, what's wrong with what's wrong with these haters out here? They drawling out here. Like, for real. Like, 
all these soulless vibrational demons that had the audacity to try to downplay what soulless vibrational beings ever expose against this big brother straw man system that enslaves humans that domesticate a lot of human citizens to not be in their actual nature a lot of these soulless vibrational demons are really looking crazy right now <laughs> i'm gonna tell you right now them righteous trailos people those shamar moss williams people the damn coley ditson people they're gonna look crazy than a motherfucker when the system crash they're going to be helpless as fuck and not know what to do when the system crash because money is not going to be no use when the system crash. FEMA camps are going to be in action. People are going to literally ha have to go like five to six hours away for resources just to come back to do the deeds of these damn fucking blood demons that want to have a lot of the, the people that fit in the matrix, you know, just obey and just be in the FEMA camps. And the FEMA camps are not going to have no technology resources. So no, nothing's going to be reported of what's going to happen in the FEMA camps. Literally. Just mark my words. I told you all this, man. All these so-called woke people, these woke religious people that, you know, claiming that they're for the cause and all that. I'm going to tell you right now. Um, That Lord Joshin, that Lord Allah, that Lord Jesus person that you all been led to just be brainwashed to follow for so long they're not going to be there they never was there when they never was there when the goddamn blood sacrifice rituals was going on i'm gonna tell you right there that jesus person was not there when Aaliyah passed away in a, in, a, in a plane crash right where was that jesus person when Aaliyah got in that plane crash where was Aaliyah when big l got shot and don't tell me that bullshit that Jesus took Big L and Aaliyah away. That's bullshit. Because the whole thing, why would that... Come on, bro. We know the story. We soul beings know the story. Come on, man. I don't got to explain myself. You people that been calling out, that been trying to make conspiracy theory label people look crazy, man. You're going to be the ones who going to wish you. you had help from these conspiracy theory label people. But hey, I rest my case. You heard it from me first. Make sure you leave a like, a comment, reshare. Try to get this to go viral because they try to shadow ban me. So because this information is too uncut for the masses. That's all I'm going to tell you.